Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss OSA zone test. So OSA zone test involves binding of the sugar molecule with the phenyl hydrazine hydrochloride to form a phenyl hydrazone hydrochloride. Now this complex reacts with another molecule of phenyl hydrazine hydrochloride to form an intermediate keto derivative, and this intermediate keto derivative reacts with another molecule of phenyl hydrazine hydrochloride to form a corresponding OSA zone. So from the reaction. It is evident that in the OSA zone formation, the first two carbon of the sugar molecule is involved with the binding of the phenyl hydrazine. So the sugar, which are differ in the configuration around first two carbon, will produce same type of OSA zone because this difference is masked by the binding of the phenyl hydrazine. So that's why glucose, fructose, and mannose will form a same type of OSA zone, that is needle shape. Maltose will form a sunflower shape of osa zone lactose will form a touch me not plant or hedge hose type of osa zone and sucrose will not form any type of osa zone because sucrose is a non reducing sugar there are lots of multiple choice question asked from this particular topic so please like share and subscribe biochemistry basics by dr amit and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get all the notifications from it thank you